Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel Go Dynamic IT. Are you worried about the safety of the file you downloaded from the internet? Whether it's an exe, txt, zip or apk file, it's crucial to take extra precaution. If you're looking to ensure your downloads are free from malware, viruses and ransomware attack, then this video is for you. Today we are diving into VirusTotal, a powerful online tool that let you scan your file before opening them on your system. So stay tuned and learn how VirusTotal can keep your computer safe and secure. But before we start, let me tell you that this is just a cyber security awareness, not a cyber security coaching. So let's get started without any further delay. Okay, so before we start, let me tell you that we normally we deal with this what type of files, Word, Excel, PowerPoint or zip file, or maybe when you are mobile phone or even to uh, gaming and application things, then we download the APK and all, right? So just for demonstration purpose, I have a three file here. The one is this uh, TXT file. The another one is the APK file, and this is the zip file. So normally, generally, what happens is, and when you receive the attachment on your email or you downloaded the file from the internet, you don't care, and they just open that file, right? Whether it's in the mobile or on your computer. So, and that is the thing that open the door and that invite your virus, malware and ransomware. So just for awareness, what we will do is we will scan this file. So assume that these files are being downloaded from the internet or somebody has sent me the, through the email, which I which I don't know. So what we'll do is we'll scan this file and see whether these are the clean file or it's with the virus file. Okay. So for that, what we will do is there is a website called virus total. So let's go to that website and uh, let me open my browser here and inside browser we have to type virus total and you can see this is the first link so we'll go and visit this first link virus total and now you can see this virus total you have for three options here one is file another one is url and third one is search right so when you click on the file here you have an option to choose the file so let's choose our file here so what where we have a file we have a file on our desktop let's go to our desktop here on the desktop we have a three file so let's just scan this confidential file somebody has sent me the file say that confidential you can see this is the virus right you can see these are the virus 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 so the single website work in the combination of 70 antivirus scanner so you can see when you scan this file it take the sample you can take the help of these antivirus you can see these are the antivirus few of you maybe know about this uh, viruses also antivirus program also right these are avast avz these are the very famous famous one kaspersky these are the they are these are the few famous one so it in total it took help of 70 antiviruses to a scan and to identify the threats on the file so you can see here these are the antivirus which caught that and you say that there are a red line and it says this is a virus this is a torsion horse so imagine a situation that you open that file on your system so any torsion or any malware will sit on the system right? and it will open the door for the other attackers like maybe it could be a malware or a ransomware attackers and all so this is the one example of your txt file now so you will be amazed to know that right so one txt file can do for you how harmful it is so let's go back and now it's time to open the let's say open this zip file so normally we think that okay this is a zip file or somebody has zipped this file and compressed the file and send it to across to us so let's open that but don't do that if you're receiving this file from any unknown user don't do that okay so let's open this file and voila you can see again it is scanned with it is scanned this file with the help of all 70 antivirus program it all says that this is the malware right and this is a virus don't do that don't open that on your system it will affect you so this is how you go ahead you just bookmark this page virustotal.com i'll just put this link in the description and do let me know in the comment box whether you have bookmarked or not this is for your safety, right? So this is the this was the second example of the file scanning. This was the zip file. Now let's go back to uh, again go back to the home page. And here in this time, what we will scan is we'll scan this APK file, right? That is what you people I know that you people keep receiving and sending this EP, APK file here and there. But that can be also be a virus. But make sure that make sure that you scan it, right? Well, how much time you can you, you can open this website link on your mobile phone and you can scan this APK file before you installing. It will take just a few seconds. Go that and scan this APK file. And it says that uh, it's, it's, it's scan. It says no any issues find, found with this file. This is the clean. You can see this is a green mark. This is the APK file and this is all undetected, undetected, undetected. So you can assume that this is the good one. You can go ahead and install it on your mobile phone. Right? This is for your safety. You just take one step ahead. So now 
this was about the apk file what most do you do on your system is it isn't it the exe file right it's absolutely the exe file you just go to the any website and download the exe file here and there right so let's go ahead and download one exe file also just for our satisfaction so click the choose file and let's go to the download i will have a couple of exe file okay this is the uh, free pdf which i have down uh, which i have created a video on it so let's uh, scan this uh, free pdf or can we go ahead and download this pdf sam so let's uh, scan this pdf sam because this is just the end atmb file so click on the open and it's uh, computing the hash and it says that no any virus found this is the clean and perfect one so you can see just take one next step ahead and it's not going to take much time for few seconds you can scan and you can be sure that this is a clean and there is nothing inside this exe file okay this is this is done so let me tell you one more thing here you can scan the url also so sometime you are trying to visit to any uh, gaming site or any torrent site or any abc site we are visiting and you're not sure whether it's a, a legitimate site or not so you can always scan the site this is one of the site url and just paste it here and after pasting that just press enter and you can see here uh, once you press the enter it says that clean this msn.com obvious we know that this is a microsoft product so this would be clean only let me show you if we can show it to you some malicious site okay so let's review this uh, url filtering so if you're not aware of the site let's say if you're visiting some unknown site or any downloadable site or unknown site and you want to make sure that website is marked as a phishing viruses kind of site so what you have to do is just copy the url so for example uh, like this so this is the website i just copy and press the link here and press the enter so when i press the enter it says that this url is marked as a malicious right this is the antivirus program or uh, virus programs are marked this is as a phishing and malicious site so don't visit that site so isn't it the useful thing yes it is it is a useful thing so use as per your due diligence so if you are scared to know the reality or the truth of this website or this type of website then you must be scared that what happens when you go to any download site and download the file because when you go to the download site there are multiple downloads button here and there here and there right and it, when you click on that link it will redirect you to some other page right but and the page which you are redirecting that may be your virus or some kind of malware kind of site but don't worry i have a solution for you so in the next video i'll show you the method where you don't have to visit any of the site which is just sitting on your computer you can download all the software you don't have to visit here and there in any of the website so just wait and watch for the next video okay so that's it for today's video right we have scanned the txt file we have scanned the zip file we have scanned our uh, apk file we have scanned our exe file then we have scanned our website right and we know how to utilize this so so do let me know in the comment box whether you know if you know the new thing and you are going to scan this in the future if you download any of these files right you can I mean, not this this is not limited to these file you can scan all the file all type of file right so that's it for today's video if you found this video helpful please subscribe for more videos like it feel free to share your thoughts or suggestion in the comment below and let me know what topics you would like to see in the future video thanks for the watching the video see you in the next one